Let's talk about the ban on blind bidding. Basically, the Liberal government wants to ban blind bidding. And this article talks about the pros and cons of it. A lot of people felt that the real estate market was out of control the last couple of months, basically because when it went into multiple offers, as it says below, the winning bids could sometimes be hundreds of thousand dollars above the next highest offer, which made a lot of buyers feel that it artificially inflated the market. Because if you know what other people are bidding, it offers price transparency, and that's a good thing. Having a buyer's bill of rights is not necessarily a bad thing, but we've got to look at the other side of the coin and realize that it does take away from the homeowner's right to sell their home in the way that they want to. But the market has cooled since January and February, so we're not going to be seeing the same kind of multiple offers we were seeing before. My personal opinion is that actually I'm all for the open auction system. I like that kind of ability to sit on a front lawn and just raise your paddle and be able to see what the other offers are. However, I do feel that we should do a little bit more digging in this because even as it says in this article here, the Australia has two clear systems. One's a treaty system, which is almost exactly like the Canadian one we have now, and the other is the open auction, which is kind of like when you sell livestock or, or art at an art gallery like having those two options is great and that's what a free market is sellers should absolutely have the right to choose between the two systems on how they want to sell their home i'm already pretty familiar with the australian system and how the bidding all works and how you have to basically meet reserve before it even goes on market before it'll sell all those kinds of things and i made a couple of videos that you can check down and um down on my page but this week, I basically did a huge deep dive into this open negotiation company who is who Crea is looking to hire to, um, you know, test pilot across different cities in Canada. Um, and I learned quite a few things. I still have tons of questions, but I learned a couple of things. So I made another video and screenshot a few of those um, systems so you can check out the next one. And if you have questions, let me know.